All right, this is Andrew here with Chemical Concepts. I wanted to show you this uh, deform that tool for our deform that anchoring system. I want to show you a little bit how the tool works and how you might use this pneumatic tool. We have another video that's showing the pneumatic, the, uh, the manual tool, but here you'll see this one. So just to back up for a second, this is a uh, honeycomb panel, and this is what the finished product would look like. So what we have is our anchoring system. This is what the anchor looks like, and this is used to give yourself a female thread in a uh, honeycomb panel. This is an aluminum honeycomb panel. You could also use them in, in fiberglass and, and, and other materials. So first thing I'm gonna show you, what this does is this acts like a, a rivet. So I'm gonna put the uh, fastener on the end here. And you see it deforms around, so what that's gonna do is deform around the skin of the honeycomb and give you some support. Then the next step is the secondary screw. This is the grub screw. You inject some uh, adhesive in here and epoxy, and then this gets threaded in there, and then what you're left with is a female thread that's securely bonded and mechanically fastened to the honeycomb panel. So I showed you the deform that operation. This is how you use it in context. So you're gonna drill your 13 millimeter hole here. I'm gonna thread my anchor on my machine. Uh, it has the M10 mandrel on there. When you get this, it's going to have a variety of different mandrels. You're going to want the M10 for this particular fastener. I'm just going to stick that in the hole there. And the machine, I don't know, that was kind of quick, but the machine automatically unthreads the fastener and you're ready for the next step. So hopefully you found that informational. And uh, again, this is Andrew with Chemical Concepts. Please give us a call at 1-800-220-1966 if you have any other questions.